Hey guys, Donna Lady Clouds here. Today I will be doing a review on something I'm extremely excited about. I have number one of, I'm not too sure how many of these are going to be made, but I have the first one. That's right guys, the first one. Fucking exciting, right? So it is Dr. Fogg's Famous Ice Cream. I don't know if that's going to be backwards for you guys or not. But they have six flavors. So they sent me this cute little bucket of all their flavors for samples. Fucking awesome, right? It's so awesome. So, here's the little lid. Comes in kind of like a little Ben & Jerry's kind of type ice cream tub. Has your warnings on the side and shit. 18 plus. That's right, guys. So no minors. Sorry, guys. I know it's cool, but it's for us adults. Kind of bring us back that nostalgia of getting that ice cream tub or... Even as an adult, you're having a shitty time. Bring out the ice cream tub. So what we have in here are the six flavors. I have the flavor card right here. So we have Polaris, which is a raspberry deep fried ice cream. We have Vega, which is a vanilla peanut butter ice cream with bananas. We have Regal. It's a churro chunk hazelnut ice cream. Uh, Sirius is a strawberry deep fried ice cream. Oh my god, my fucking favorite. I, I'm surprised I could save some. I'm left for the review. It's so fucking good. I wish I had a 30 ml of it. And then Alpha, which is a watermelon tropical sorbet. And Supernova vanilla is a vanilla bean ice cream with caramel silk drizzle. So let's get into this. So I'm going to take these tiny, cute, little 5 ml bottles. Like, oh my god, aren't they cute? Like, look at these guys. They're so adorable. I love them. But we're going to leave my favorite one to last because that's the one I want stuck in my RDA. So I think we're going to start with Supernova. And it's the vanilla bean ice cream with caramel silk drizzle. Let's see what it's like. I've tried all of these, but I'm just going to describe them to you guys. Alright, so Supernova. So I definitely pick up on the vanilla bean, uh, like, it's in between the inhale and the exhale. It's kind of like when you're in between there and it, like, sits on the back of your tongue. And then you get a slight bit of caramel, but it's not that, like, overpowering caramel, which I fucking, I can't stand that overpowering caramel. It's just too much. I like that light kind of, just a little hint of it kind of thing. And that's what I got right now. So that is awesome. It's definitely really good. Like, I think my least favorite one out of all of these would have had to either be Polaris or Alpha. And the rest of them I fucking loved. And uh, it's definitely really good. It's max VG. Let's see if there's a 75% VG. I think all of them are the same. Yep, that one's 75% VG. It's got great cloud production for 75% VG. I am also running at 200 watts, uh, 0.12 ohms, so it's that might contribute to my awesome cloud production, but it's great cloud production. It's not that hard PG that's on your throat or anything like that, because so, I can't stand that PG shit. I love straight BG, so. But most experienced vapors do. Next, we're getting Gilfer Vega. Which is the vanilla peanut butter ice cream with bananas. And I really liked this one. It was actually the first one that caught my eye in the bucket. And I took it out and started vaping it. Let's go again. And these cute little drippers. I can't get over how cute they are. The little droppers are just adorable. I've never had a glass bottle that small. dying so with that I don't really pick up much of the vanilla but I definitely pick up the peanut butter on the exhale it could use a tiny bit more banana because really the only place I actually pick up the banana is when you're actually just bringing the RDA to your mouth and you can smell the banana but I can't taste it I can get a little bit of the creaminess of the ice cream for sure uh, it might play the vanilla might play a part in that as well it's really good. I think it's my second favorite out of the line. Oh, 
Next we'll do Polaris. That's the raspberry deep fried ice cream. Yeah. These little bottles are so hard to open. Alright, halfway! So you definitely get that raspberry. You get the raspberry like intense. It's a really nice raspberry. I think it might have been the alpha I didn't like as much. The raspberry, it's very deep. You don't really get much of the deep fry, but you get the creamy, nice, creamy raspberry. And if you're definitely if you're craving that creamy raspberry, this is definitely the juice for you. Dry that off a bit. Next we have the Regal, which is the Chiro Chunk Hazelnut Ice Cream. And I personally am not a huge fan of hazelnut, but you can't really taste the hazelnut in here, which I really like because I'm not, it's not my thing really. I like hazelnut for food, not for vaping. But this one's actually really good because you mostly pick up on the cinnamon and the churro. So I have a problem saying cinnamon all the time. It usually comes out with cinnamon. Some like ambulance and a few other things. But that's my problem. Dyslexia. Thank you guys. So you definitely get that beautiful cinnamon churro kind of like it's really close to the fucking Bigfoot from Decoded and they are made by the same people so I wouldn't doubt if they use the exact same flavorings in it for this one as well but it's really good it's probably my third favorite out of the entire line You get a little bit cream of the creaminess. I don't notice any of the hazelnut, which is amazing because I don't like hazelnut, like I said. So it's really good that I don't pick up on any of that hazelnut. It's getting foggy in here. I'm sorry, guys. You can't see me. So I'm creating a little bit of a smoke show here for myself. Next we'll do Alpha, and Alpha is the Watermelon Tropical Sorbet, and I'm not really a tropical vapor, I'm, I've never really got into those tropical flavors, the most tropical that I get is coconut, and that's really whitewash as is, because it's put in everything, we fucking love freaking coconut, guys, it's put in everything, but I don't like the pineapple, I don't really like the... I love mango. Um, guava is okay, but something guava kind of like hurts the throat just a little bit. It's a little harsh sometimes. So first thing I pick up is the tropical on the inhale, and then the watermelon kind of sits on your tongue. It's blended really nicely. It is like you're eat eating a sorbet. It's really good. It's just the tropicalness kind of throws me off. I if it was just watermelon sorbet, I'd be all over it but because it's tropical watermelon or watermelon tropical sorbet it's not really my thing cloud production is still great throughout the entire line and last but not least my favorite I would probably only have three more drips left in this not like drip drops but like Three more times of filling my RDA and it's gone. So here's to one of them. Now I'll probably only have like two, but it's my favorite. So this one automatically got me. It's got that, it's either fresh strawberry or ripe strawberry taste to it. It's just fucking beautiful. You get that nice deep fried taste and then you get like the ice cream, the creaminess, and it just all kind of comes together in this beautiful fucking beautiful mess. I love it. That strawberry though, it's, 
I can't even explain it, guys. If you are looking for that perfect strawberry vape, this is the one. Serious by Dr. Fogg's Famous Ice Cream. Seriously, serious. I'm serious about this shit. S-I-R-I-U-S about this shit. You guys have to try it. If you haven't tried it yet, definitely go try it. You can get these little buckets at premiumlabs.ca. I'm not too sure exactly how much they're going for, but I'm sure you can find it on the site. Um... They should be coming out soon if they're not out already, so check them out. Definitely take a look at their page. I've had many Premium Labs juices sent to me, and all of them have been fucking amazing, guys. He puts a lot of time and effort into his juices, and you can really tell that he puts that quality into it. His lab is phenomenal. If you guys haven't seen his lab, look on his Facebook page. He posts pictures of his lab, and it's just phenomenal. One great clean facility, and that's what everybody wants. So check them out. Um... Maybe I'll be able to do like a giveaway with them soon or maybe a promotional code for you guys so you guys can get a little bit of a deal on them. Um, I will talk to them about that and see what I can do for you guys. And yeah, so this concludes the review of Premium Labs Dr. Fogg's Famous Ice Cream. And yeah, so thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and happy vaping.